And we're back. Uh, JMU with four, Western still with zero. 5.45 left to play in the game. Quick update, looks like over at the Grand Valley VCU game, uh, Grand Valley four, the DePaul Central Michigan game, uh, that, turned into, that turned into a garden party ages ago. The sign says four to 26, but I think that might've been someone from DePaul got a hold of the scoreboard. And uh, let's see, BGSU and Michigan State, still Michigan State three, uh, BGSU one with six minutes remaining. So I see, uh, I see Saginaw Valley all warming up. Now, because of the number of teams that we have left, after this round, are there some teams that are going to play another game immediately after this round? Uh, yeah, I think so. Um, well, I don't know. That's a good question. That would be a question for Zig. I would think that, yeah, some teams will go right into the next round, which can hurt you and can also play into your advantage. I think once you sit for a little bit and start to get cold, you know, start to tighten up a little bit, I don't think some teams would mind jumping straight into the next round of games. Yeah, I could see. And, you know, as long as the team is given, you know, 10, 15 minutes to get some water, cool down, stretch out a little bit. But, yeah, I agree. You know, going into a game warm is can I guess be, can that makes help. sense because we're, we're narrowing it down from 16 to eight teams. Eight teams will play four games. We've got four courts. So I'm pretty sure we would be having uh, all the teams going right here, right now. All righty. Well... We will be here to broadcast as many games as we can. Uh, we'll try to maybe choke some food down at some point. I'm hungry, Jazzy. Uh, and we'll move on from there. Uh, I, told the, I told the fine folks at home, at least for the championship game, we will do two streams, one from my account, one from Ben's account, to at least maybe a track view and a down the court view to give people as much coverage as we possibly can. Sounds good. Over there here are the Spartans and the, the Bowling Green State University. The Spartans are um, throwing the, way game, uh, the game away a little bit as far as the point. Um, they're hubris. They're throwing a lot, of, uh, a lot of catches in the last few minutes. They were down to three Bowling Green State, and they got two catches in a row, and then another one, so they're back to six players. They no longer have the 10-second shot clock. So, uh, you know, BGSU maybe coming back. Not enough time, I don't think, though. Just letting you know. Much appreciated, Ben. Subcheck. So yeah, I think, uh, you know, all, all four of the games we've had going on right now have all been blowouts. Well, I take that back. Uh, BGSU did, uh, like Ben was saying, they took a point from uh, Michigan State, and they're still kind of hanging in with 3.53 left in their game. But uh, this next round of eight should be interesting because we're, we're going to start getting to teams that I think are all on, on roughly the same level, uh, you know, experiencing gameplay-wise. So, th much this, yeah, much closer games, I think, this next couple of rounds. So I, I wish I had the schedule in front of me because I wish that I could go ahead and lay out yeah, what the round. Out. Okay, we'll try to do that. Uh, we still got 2.30 left in this game. Uh, so we'll swap hands on the camera here and uh, we'll, be, we'll try to lay out what our round of eight games are going to look like. Uh, nope, camera, hand, hand in front of the lens there. Still hand in front of the lens and we're clear now. Good, perfect. All righty, all righty, all righty. Ooh. Starting, it's supposed to start at 12:45, so we're running a little bit behind here on day two. I guess it was bound to catch up since we ran pretty much on time for day one. Looks like uh, we will go straight into four games during the round of eight, and then from then on out, teams will be playing back-to-back -back games, so no rest. Uh, the teams that get a break here from one round of the first round of 16 to the next, no more breaks from here on out. We will jump straight into the round of eight. Uh, here after this round wraps up. All right, do, we, do we know what the uh, what the who's who's against who for that? Yeah, let me. I can kind of work out our matchups here. Give me. Okay, this. minute 26 left. We'll see how good Jazzy is at that. See if we can get a finish in that time. Uh, 120, one minute 20 seconds in the WQ JMU game. Two minutes remaining in the BGSU Michigan State game. So Alex stepping out to go tape an ankle for us. Um, looks like for Michigan State, so we will finish up this stream. And I'm going to try to figure out for you guys uh, who all is going to be matched up. It sounds like Towson was saying they're going to be playing JMU. So we know we've got that matchup coming up here in the next round. 
And we also have all of the Michigan all of the Michigan schools still alive. Towson still alive. Um, let's see. UWP still alive, and UK still alive. So outside of your four Michigan schools, you have JMU, UK, Towson, and UWP left. Okay, so the winner of game one, which will be Grand Valley, will play the winner of game two, which will be UWP. So next round, we will have Grand Valley versus UWP. The winner of game three, which was Saginaw Valley, will play the winner of game four, which looks like it's going to be Michigan State. So Michigan State versus Saginaw Valley coming up. Also the winner of game, oh, that's the end of this game. We'll keep it right here for just a second to give you the updates as JMU does take the four nothing victory over host school WKU. So we just said Michigan State versus Saginaw Valley. The winner of game five, which was Towson, We'll play the winner of game six, which is this game right here. So JMU versus Towson. And that leaves, uh, looks like seven and eight, which was UK versus Central Michigan. So there you go. Grand Valley versus UWP, MSU versus Saginaw Valley, JMU versus Towson, and Central Michigan versus UK. That does it for us. Saginaw Valley versus MSU, yes. That is correct, yes. So those are your next round of games, which will be starting here shortly. We will bring you all the